We swim in a sea of language. Language shapes perception. Well, language is a very powerful tool. Language can be used to liberate. People will automatically assume, because you can't walk, or because you can't talk, or because you can't see, that you are more vulnerable, that you need to be taken care of. Isn't necessarily true. I don't consider myself vulnerable, um, even though I am a person with a disability. People with disabilities are not inherently more vulnerable than anyone else. I'd rather people treated me not as, as vulnerable, but with dignity and respect. Everybody's vulnerable. Each and every one of us can be vulnerable. The truth is that we're all vulnerable. People are made vulnerable. I think the worst word for people to be described as is suffering. It's, it's highly detrimental to our lives. Suffering is a dehumanizing term. They are not suffering. I don't think persons with disabilities are suffering. No, I don't suffer from polio. All language can be challenged and changed not a pity person. They don't want pity, they don't want sympathy. It just perpetuates the stereotype. Our lives are rich and they are complex. I'm not a victim, I'm not suffering, I'm not, you know, vulnerable. I'm just me. We can reclaim language.